Hi, I'm Mr. Pablington. Welcome to my channel. If you are here, you're probably a new viewer. So please, please, please hit the subscribe button because we need to beat the algorithm. Today, I'm bringing you the unboxing of my Virtual Boy and a couple of games. A little bit of trivia. I bought this over 20 years ago, I think, on eBay for a hundred US dollars. You can do the math how much that is today. It's probably like 120, 130 US dollars now. You will see in the rest of the video how much Virtual games and hardware goes for today. I'm really excited. It's a bit of an old console from Nintendo. Uh, and still, it's a really interesting collector's item. I hope you enjoy the show. Hit the like button and I'll see you on the other side. The first thing you will notice here is the box art. I'm obsessed with this. You can see the headset, you can see the controller, and it's a very, very particular art style that I, I haven't seen before. I'll press pause here so you can appreciate it as well. It's actually very similar to the Japanese Nintendo 64 box of the time. Included in the box, you will find the red headset, the controller, and the stand. And in the original release, it also came with a copy of Mario Tennis. The controller is actually very interesting because it's like the precursor of the Nintendo 64 one. You can see it has the power on and off button, two cross pads, A, B, and select. On the back, you can see where the six AA batteries went, LNR buttons. Uh, yeah, six AA batteries because uh, it didn't include an AC adapter. This is the headset, which is not too heavy. You can see that the two gray switches at the top help with the positioning of the screens to get the best 3D effect as possible. You can see the two red screens in here and it has the volume control and the port where you plug in the controller on the back. When it launched in 1995, it was priced at around $180, or the equivalent of $300 today. The Virtual Boy was discontinued a year later, so this was a massive flop for Nintendo, as it only sold 770,000 units. It's pretty uncomfortable and not portable at all, so I can see why it fails. This is how much it's going for these days. This is all we have today. I hope you enjoyed the unboxing of the Virtual Boy and my games. Please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button as well. And here, uh, but here are now two videos <laughs> that you might enjoy as well around here. See you next time and keep on collecting.